Rachel is going to be all right. The knife damaged her brachial artery, but didn't cut it. She's out of surgery, and now she's resting. Chloe, what happened? It's my fault. I should have listened to you. Sarah's mixed up somehow with this psycho Damon Merrick. I know exactly who Damon Merrick is. Start over and tell me everything. Did you and Rachel try to contact Sarah? I'm not going to chastise or blame you, Chloe but I need the whole story. So, I got my dealer to meet us since he knows Sarah. Frank Bowers. Yeah, that's right. But Damon showed up with him. What did Merrick want? I, I think he wanted to scare us, so he'd stop asking questions about his business. Is that how it became violent? When he found out Rachel was the DA's daughter, he, he wanted information about you. And how did he know that I'm her father? I, I don't know. Maybe he's seen her before. What happened next? Damon had a knife out, and we all could see it. But then he said something that pissed Rachel off. And she just grabbed a piece of wood and hit him. And then he stabbed her. I keep thinking that maybe I could have done something, but when he attacked her, I just froze. It's not your fault. And Frank held him off so we could get to the truck. I heard a scream, but I don't know what happened. And then we were here. I appreciate you telling me the truth. What if Rachel still wants to meet Sarah? After all this, I'm hoping she'll finally see reason. I was told that if Rachel had arrived only a few minutes later, she might not have, um... Thank you, Chloe. You saved my world. It will be some time before Rachel wakes up. I promise. I'll let you know when she does. Okay. Thanks. Hey. Steph. How's Drew? Pretty good. Miss Amber just told me Rachel's going to be okay. I'm really glad. Yeah. Well, our room's just down the hall. You should come by. Okay. Sure. Definitely. I don't think I can sit still any longer. Might as well stretch my legs while I wait for Rachel to wake up.
Come on. <laughs> Not that I have any coins anyway. <laughs> oh man. Jackpot. Pretty sure the hospital nutritionists meet here after hours and pig out. If I want to stay sane, I need to stay busy. What's there to do around here? Are these all firefighters? Mom brought so many of these home when Dad died, and not a single one described how I felt. Being in a hospital this long sucks. I just want Rachel to wake up, and then I'll feel better. I owe Frank big time. Can't believe he did that for us. I hope he's okay. Not like I can do anything about it in one way or the other. And what about Damon? Is, is he gonna come after us? I actually feel better knowing that James Amber is on his case. Ugh, that's weird. One more hour of waiting and I would have read that. Guess the citizens of Arcadia Bay aren't feeling so generous. Sean Prescott. What's he writing to the hospital about? Frank's business must be booming. Shit. I really hope he's okay. Oh shit. I know those guys. Uh, this doesn't look like the maternity wing. Uh, there's a sign for the prenatal class. I can't believe we're finally doing this! I'm so excited! <laughs> You're gonna be a good dad. I <laughs> guess I'm glad we stole their wine. This poster seems to be missing some context. What to draw, what to draw. Okay, nurses. The world wants to know. What's so funny?
If I want to stay sane, I need to... I think this vending machine could be improved. <laughs> oh, yeah. I get it. Nurse, I'll need my forceps to extract this baby Ruth. Pretty sure the hospital nutritionists meet here after hours and pig out. Is this Drew's room? Is that Mikey and Drew's dad? I wonder how he's doing. All right then. Thank you. Hi, Mr. North. That's me. And you are? I'm Chloe. You here to see Drew? Yeah. How are, uh, how are things going? Oh, you know how it is. Ups and downs. Drew's hurt, of course. But there's other things going well for us. Uh, I'm moving back into my, my old apartment in two and a half hours. I don't know if you know this, but uh, Mikey's been crashing at Drew's dorm. Oh? Uh, I had a bit of trouble with work. And it's all been pretty hard. Anyway, Drew managed to scrape together enough to get me back on my feet. I'm glad things are starting to work out then. Oh no. You said you were Chloe. Mikey's mentioned you a few times now. I have a question maybe you can answer. Sure. Both of those boys have been acting a little, well, guilty lately. Yeah, I've, I've been spending most of my time looking for work. I'm worried I missed something important. Do you know if anything's going on with them? You should probably ask Drew. I, uh... Don't really know any details. I do know that whatever it is, they did it because they wanted to help you. Thanks, Chloe. They actually have helped me out. Money-wise. We're a family, you know? We deal with things together. Oh, excuse me. I hope the Norths are going to be all right. Hey! You made it. Oh. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. How's your knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh... I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Sorry to hear it. It's, it's all good. Hmm. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. I figured it might fit with my new barbarian look. You know, a war paint. Awesome! Nerds. Hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. Rachel's stable. She'll probably wake up soon. How'd she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? 
She got stabbed in the arm by demon fucking Merrick. Seriously? It, it wasn't because of me, was it? No. Somehow we've got our own shit with him now. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? Uh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. Don't have too much fun now. Try to keep it appropriate for the hospital. Bye, Dad. See ya, Pops. Man. Maybe... I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's gonna be up soon. Should probably head over when I'm ready. Drew looks really low. Hey. Sorry for losing it there. It's nice of you to come by. Yeah, no problem. Easier than you coming to me. <laughs> you know what? I'm kind of tired. Oh. Oh, right, right. I'll, um, I'll leave you alone. Oh, I want to eat that. Right now. Those must be from Steph's parents. I wonder if Drew will ever play again. Look at that. Wells being nice for a change. It's nice that Mikey and Steph seem to be staying here all day. I think the football team needs thicker helmets. Yep. Definitely too many concussions. That'll be an interesting read. Drew's been in a lot of pain today. Drew looks really low. Ooh, I want to eat that 
right now. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, y you don't want that pudding, right? Uh, I'll take it off your hands for you. Over my dead body. Wonder if a little friendly competition will cheer Drew up. Let's see if I can convince Drew that I need the pudding more than he does. Good thing we're in a hospital because they'll know exactly what to do with your corpse. Oh. <laughs> you don't scare me, Chloe Price. Ah! Are you sure about that? Because it looks like you're kind of scared of me. Doesn't matter. I'm going to eat this pudding, and there's nothing you can do about it. Is that what your coach would want? You don't want to lose your edge, you know. You're getting a little soft. And by soft, I mean fat. If you loved pudding as much as I do, you might understand. If you love something, let it go. It's the noble thing to do. No. That's something losers say. Who are you calling a loser? I'm not the one who lost the use of my leg. She went there. Oh, shit. She's not gonna quit, is she? Okay. I give in. We can share it. <laughs> All right. But don't get used to it. <laughs> Sucker. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Why are you even in my room? Mm, so good. Mm, mm, mm hmm. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Hey. Can I sign your cast? Go for it. Hmm. Something encouraging. But not too encouraging. There you go. Thanks a lot. Anytime. It's kind You're of nice scary, that Chloe. I can bum around here way. while I'm waiting for In Rachel. The best way. All right, I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? Next time, you better bring me a snack. Next time, for sure. Oh, and Chloe? Yeah? Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet. Those guys look exhausted. Went out? You mean it's controlled? No, it's completely out. Unless you get stabbed. Everything about this fire is gonna be. 
I'm so glad Rachel's okay. Really can't wait to... You didn't have to bring the ice cream. Is that... Samantha Myers? I feel bad. Holy shit. Is that Nathan Prescott? It wasn't your fault. I'm a klutz. Oh, God. Nathan and Samantha? Together? What have I done? I should have seen that biker, though. <laughs> I just think it's sweet you wanted to take my photograph. Of course. I think it came out really well, too. Wait till you see it. I really regret overhearing that. Hey. Chloe, I can't even express thank you so much. I'm sorry. I'm a wreck. I stepped out to get some air. Rachel doesn't need me crying in front of her. Your hair. I almost didn't notice it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's not a big deal. I bet Rachel loves it. I can't imagine what I would do if we lost her. I'm sure everything's going to be fine. That's what James keeps saying. He's so strong in a crisis, you know? My dad was like that. I'm sure he was. Just like his daughter. I don't know about that. You saved her, didn't you? When everything happened, I just... I froze up. That you were there for her when she needed you. That's what matters. I am so glad you and Rachel have found each other. When you meet someone who changes everything, you just know. Well, hang in there, Mrs. Amber. I will.